The evolving global trade dynamics have given rise to a distinctive trade symbiosis among China, Vietnam, and the United States. This relationship has emerged primarily due to a set of tariff policies implemented by the United States in reaction to its trade conflict with China. The reduction in direct trade between the United States and China unexpectedly catalyzed a spike in Vietnam's exports, while also resulting in a significant uptick in Vietnam's imports from China. As per data from trade, customs, and investment sources such as the United Nations, China, Vietnam, and the United States, the prominence of this symbiotic trade relationship has grown increasingly evident in recent years. Vietnam's trade surplus last year stemmed predominantly from exports to the United States, totaling 105 billion US dollars. This figure marks a substantial increase, 1.5 times higher, from the 4 billion US dollar surplus during the onset of the trade war initiated by the Trump administration against China. Consequently, Vietnam has ascended in rank, surpassing China, Mexico, and the European Union on the list of countries contributing to the US trade deficit, drawing significant international attention in the process. At the heart of this symbiotic relationship lies Vietnam's role as a crucial conduit for Chinese goods entering the U.S. market. The synergy between the competitive edge of Chinese products and Vietnam's stature as a manufacturing hub has fueled a significant upsurge in Vietnamese exports to the United States. Consequently, to meet the demands of its export-oriented economy, Vietnam must import substantial quantities of raw materials and semi-finished goods from China. According to World Bank data, the growth rate of Vietnam's imports from China closely mirrors both the total value and growth rate of its exports to the United States, exhibiting an exceptionally high correlation of 96%. Expert analysis suggests that behind this symbiotic relationship may lie the strategy of Chinese-funded enterprises aiming to circumvent U.S. tariffs via Vietnam. Numerous Chinese-funded companies have opted to relocate their factories to northern Vietnam, leveraging Vietnam's labor advantages and tax policies to add value to semi-finished products before exporting them to the United States. However, this practice has drawn scrutiny from the U.S. Department of Commerce, as some products labeled as made in Vietnam may not have undergone any actual value-added activities in Vietnam. For Vietnam, securing market economy status from the United States will be a pivotal milestone in enhancing its trade relations with the country. The Vietnamese government is diligently pursuing recognition from the United States, while also focusing on enhancing its trade structure and investment climate. Nevertheless, amid a globally intricate and volatile trade landscape, Vietnam's ability to strike a balance in its trade relations with both China and the United States will be a significant challenge it must navigate in the future. Tune in every Monday to Friday at 8 p.m. for Qingxiao View, The Business Bridge.